Hey y'all, what's up and welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be doing a little bit of an unboxing. It just recently came and I feel like there's enough to kind of do a little bit of a haul now. Which actually makes me very excited because I can finally play with some of this stuff. But um, we've got three little packages here to open up. And I figured y'all could uh, open them up with me. And thank you so much for subscribing to my channel if you're a newbie. Um, I hit 85 today and I really appreciate that. Welcome to the family. So yeah, just wanted to say thanks real quick and then let's go ahead and get into this haul, shall we? Alright, so the first thing that we will be opening is from Amazon. And I ordered this. I have Amazon Prime. So... It's supposed to come in two days. It was supposed to be here actually yesterday, but I don't know what happened. It said it was out for delivery, and then it just never showed up. I waited and waited, but it never showed up, but that's cool. It just made today that much better. So this is actually a face painting kit, and I have an oil-based kit or grease paint, whatever you want to call it, and I love that thing, but the makeup isn't really like permanent enough for me like if I touch my face even after setting it it can still move around with this stuff it is water activated so unless I sweat like crazy the review said that it should not come off so I should be able to take pictures and stuff and I purchased this for Halloween this year because y'all know I said I'm going to be doing the 30 days of Halloween or 31 days however many it is I'm not sure but I'm really excited to play around with this palette and if I could just open it I will show you what it looks like <laughs> we're struggling over here all right finally so we got it open and this is the colors that's in here I will open it up but I just wanted you to see the packaging and it actually feels really nice and sturdy so I'm excited about that and it came with two little brushes already inside this one kind of looks like it's used I don't, I'm sure it's not but you never know but it just says that you activate them with water and these are supposed to be face paints for kids so I figure if it's safe for kids then it's plenty good enough for me and um, yeah like I said I just really have a lot of videos in mind where I need some face paint and I love that grease paint stuff but it just doesn't always do the trick and I said in one of my other videos that if you guys have any requests on any videos you would like to see me do for Halloween make sure to leave it in the comments down below um, I did get one request for Edward Scissorhands and that was actually from my aunt we done that one year for Halloween and um, I did a somewhat version of Edward Scissorhands last year but my hair was the wrong color and I have not invested in wigs or anything yet. So um, I just did like a suntanned <laughs> version of Edward Scissorhands. But I will definitely be recreating my Edward Scissorhands this year for you. So yeah, be looking out for that one in October. Alright, that was all we got from Amazon. So now let's jump into the first Ulta box. Now I'm not sure what's in either one of these. Um, I mean, I know what's in them, but I don't know which one has which product because I ordered them at different times and they took really a long time to come in, I think, but I'm bad for ordering stuff on the weekend and then it just, you know, seems like it takes forever when really it takes normal time. Alright, so in this first box, we have these little, uh puffy things which I will give to my son who is actually sitting here next to me he absolutely loves these things and always wants to play with them I'm not going to give them to him just yet because he will pop them and scare the crap out of me while I'm filming but I will go ahead and set them down so he can pick them up later all right and then in the box is an eyeliner from Catrice Cosmetics um, I'm in a Facebook group and one of the girls on there recommended Catrice Cosmetics, so I went ahead and picked up a liner. I want to say this was around $5.99. I will look it up and link it down below for you guys, but all of their makeup is actually really affordable, and I want to try some more of it. But for now, I just went ahead and got a basic liner and a setting spray because I'm running low. So this is the Prime and Fine Multi-Talent Fixing Spray, and I actually really like the packaging on this. It looks very luxurious. Let's see the mister on this thing. Come on now. Oh yeah, that's a really good mist. 
and it smells nice too. It smells really clean. But it says it's a lightweight and quick drying spray that can be used as a primer, as refreshment, and for setting makeup. It says that it improves makeup wear and gives a perfect finish. That's a decent amount of spray. I should not need to buy any more for quite some time. I wish I could explain that smell though. It's really nice. It's a very clean scent. I like that. And I just realized that I did not show you what the liner looks like. So we'll go ahead and do that too. It looks like a felt tip tip applicator. Let's get a... No, it's actually a... Is it a felt tip? Yeah, it's a felt tip, but it's a very bendy felt tip. And you can get a very fine line with that. So that's going to make doing wings pretty awesome. And this is waterproof as well. So... And then the last thing that was in that box is two little sample perfumes. These are the Marc Jacobs Decadence perfumes. And I think they're both the same. Yeah, they're both the same scent. It says that it is sultry, luxurious, indulgent, sensual. La 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 la. We'll go with those three. I don't know what the other things say. <laughs> so we're just going to stick with that. And I th actually, I think this is for a dude. Is this for a dude? I don't know. So let's smell it. What do you think? Does it smell good? Yeah. Huh? Alright, so we're just going to go ahead and jump into the last package. And this one is again from Ulta. And now that I've opened the first package, I know exactly what's in this one. And I am extremely pumped y'all might be pumped when you see this one too all right so the first thing that's in this one is some more perfume samples this one has they always come in this little baggie but this one has the i love juicy couture couture i cannot say that word juicy couture couture perfume or at least it's supposed to mine's missing Oh well, it happens. And then this one is the Aqua de Jao perfume. So that's exciting. And then Ulta had a special going on where if you spent $19.50, you got a free 12-piece makeup bag. And you got to pick whether you wanted the pink and orangey tones or the blue tones. And because it was already a water-looking bag, I went with the blue tones. And I'm not sorry. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. But it's got 12 pieces of makeup in here. So we're just going to unravel this mess and see what's in here. That's something I really, really enjoy about Ulta is that they often do these little promotions where you get all this makeup. And it looks like there's actually a $5 um coupon in here as well but here is all the makeup that came in here so the first thing in here is this little eyeliner and i will be completely honest with you i got one of these eyeliners a while ago in one of these little deals and i was a little bit less than impressed i wasn't really a fan and it had this same purple shade on it but this end was green this one is now black so maybe it'll be a little bit more promising because black is more something that i would wear anyways plus even if I don't use it on my eyes, a lot of times if products don't work on my eyes, I can use them for gore makeup and stuff. So, there's that. And then I got another mascara from Ulta. This one is the Maximum Lashes Defining and Lengthening Mascara. Um, the last one that I got, I've actually been using it quite a bit. I like it. And I'm always on the market for a new mascara anyway, so... Yay for that. Okay, um, I've never used one of these before. <laughs> this is a lip primer. It says that it is color enhancing. And it's just like a white, clear lipstick looking thing. So that'll be exciting for, especially like when I wear darker lip colors. Maybe it'll help with extra color payoff. You never know. Then we have a matte lip crayon. This one is in the shade Soiree. But it's a really pretty red shade. It feels very creamy as well. So that's always a bonus. And while I'm at it, I'll go ahead and swatch these eyeliners as well. Because I did not do that. So the black one actually feels really creamy. Which is like making me out to be a total liar. And the purple one is... It's alright. I mean, it's not the worst and it's not the best. 
but there are those two shades maybe once you start working with them and warm them up I think they'll be just fine oh no dropping everything up next we have a tinted eye primer and it's satin blush you could actually probably just put this on your eyelids and then set it with some translucent powder and it might look all right don't know but we can find out the next thing in here is this little eyeshadow palette now I actually really enjoy these little things the packaging you know is a little bit meh on them but the eyeshadows themselves are absolutely gorgeous I'll go ahead and swatch a couple of them so this is the pinky shimmery shade and then we'll go ahead and swatch one of the matte shades so here is the purpley matte shade and I think these colors will be absolutely gorgeous for fall oh how cute there's a little matching mirror in here I didn't even know this is part of it but the mirror actually matches the makeup bag and it's just just a mirror but it's not it doesn't close or anything which you can decide if that would be a nuisance to you I don't personally care and then here is the little coupon thingamajig and it's for five dollars off of any Ulta Beauty collection purchase of fifteen dollars or more which is awesome okay up next we have this little face palette right here this is another one of those little Ulta brand things this is all Ulta brand actually I don't know what I'm talking about but it's got a matte bronzer it's got a shimmering like highlight shade and then it's got a matte white shade I guess you could use that for setting your face and whatnot oh that's really silky that white shade is really silky y'all and then they seem to always include a sharpener and a brush in their little kits so that's two of the things in here is just a little sharpener and a little brush which I guess would be for your face palette and then the last thing in this little bag was this color rush lip gloss in the shade Olivia and it actually looks real cute y'all it's a very pretty shade it's almost a fall shade for me but it's a little bit too pink for that but we could probably darken it up a bit with some lip liner all right and then the very last thing which is the thing that I am the most excited for <laughs> that was a terrible rendition of angel voices but I got the Melissa Michelle palette from Ulta Beauty and you guys I love Melissa Michelle I think that she is so pretty and just down to earth of course I've never met the lady but just her personality what she puts out on the internet is just I don't know I just love the way that she is and I'm so happy to be able to support her in buying this palette and if you don't know who she is it is this lady right here and on YouTube she just does all kinds of tutorials and fashion stuff and she's got two little kids and they're just absolutely adorable so any way that I could help somebody that I look up to of course I would do that but it doesn't hurt that the palette itself is absolutely gorgeous these are the shades that are in here it comes with its own lipstick as well and then it's got a highlighter and a bronzer yeah I was, and it actually has a really cute little mirror up here and it says can't wait to see your looks and it just says Melissa Michelle X Ulta so yeah I'm really really excited to have this palette and I plan on doing a look with this palette very soon and also a review with swatches so if you guys would like to see that make sure to give this video a thumbs up and leave me a comment down below and you know just I don't know I'm so excited I can't wait to play with it but um yeah I'm just really excited and grateful because I was so scared that I wasn't going to be able to get this but I finally got my hands on it so yay for that <laughs> and that's all for now guys I know this was a long one it probably wouldn't have been so long if I hadn't went through each of those 12 pieces of makeup that came in that kit but you know it was part of it so I figured why not go ahead and share the love but yeah that's all I have for you for now thanks so much for watching don't forget to subscribe before you leave and always be you